Did you guys finally get a little break here? Obviously, you know, exams, but but still, no, um, the no, games no, no, are no, over no. with. No, no, no. <laughs> for a little bit. I mean, it's, it's a break from games. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That, yeah. That's about it. Yeah, yeah. Um, what are you really going to focus on outside of the academic work over these next 11 days? Shoot a lot of free throws. Mm -hmm. <laughs> get a little running in. Yeah, so that's about it. What's been the most challenging thing you've had to adjust to since the games actually started about a month ago? Uh, intensity, the intensity of, of the game, just basically keeping the same energy the whole time. Because it's, I mean, it's easy to come out there the first five minutes to play hard. Like once you 15 minutes in, and in the second half you need to stop. That's when. That's when it's kind of. That's when it's pretty hard. Do you notice um, the need to pick it up, maybe to match your teammates, or is it the opponents, or is it both? Well, I think it's to match my teammates because Kenny plays really hard, and he's he's the leader by example. So I'm trying to just I'm out there trying to match what he does. And, and you've also got Joel and you got Theo and Luke. These are guys that how uh, sort of have a lunch pail mentality when they go out yeah. there. Um, being a big, you kind of always have to have a lunch pail mentality just to survive in there. Has that been an adjustment too for you? Yeah, it has. I mean, seeing those guys, I mean, those are our leaders. I just try to follow them. Yeah, you're, you're a coach's son, and I think one of the things that Coach Smith, or Coach Williams, Coach Smith, I'm going back 20 years, Coach Williams said about you before the season started was that you kind of have a, a, a lot of basketball IQ, a lot of savvy and stuff like that. How, how has that kind of helped you through the first month, just being maybe a little bit further ahead than a lot of other freshman bigs because you understand the basketball game, you understand angles, footwork, and that kind of stuff? It helps a lot. Not a lot, but I mean, I, I kind of try to – Combine what my dad taught me and everyone else has, and combine with Coach Williams, and it, it really turns out to help. Is there um, is there an area other than maybe the intensity that maybe you struggled the most with, sort of getting used to at the college level? Uh, playing defense beforehand, like but before the ball crossed that point, playing defense before then, getting in, getting in position, stuff like that. I struggled with doing that the first couple of games, but now I'm used to it. Coach actually said the last said yesterday when we talked to him that the previous couple of games you've done a lot better job fronting bigs. Is that has that been part yeah, of the process for you? I was out there. I, I was I was getting killed, and uh, I think that was one of the problems why some of the games were so close. Because I mean, guys out there scoring freely, and it's a real issue. Because I'm a, it seems like I'm a liability. I I didn't want that. Cool. Thanks.